Look, completionist. This is our guest on the show. Where the show name is Guest from. Hello, everyone. Hello. Oh my God. Hi. See, for for everybody at home, no time has passed. Mm -hmm. But for us, we haven't recorded in like a month. Yeah, more than that. I was on the road with NSP um, for six weeks, I think. Six weeks. I think so. Jeez. I know it's been insane. I, I missed even you. Washed my underwear in six weeks. How was the, how was the tour? Thank you. This is the completionist, everyone. By the Hi. way, <laughs> Gerard, the completionist. It was wonderful. It he was completes. a fantastic experience, and you know, with with COVID, oh. Yeah, we can say COVID. It's yeah, twenty. It now, it's yeah. twenty twenty two, yeah. baby. You're gonna, you're um, just gonna piss off all the fans who are like, "No, it's the Backstreet Boys." <laughs> yeah, yeah. Sorry, guys. Backstreet's always back. All right. Yeah, yeah, they'll they'll be back forever. Yeah. But, um, yeah, it like that. Like I was telling you before we started the show, it it kind of gave us this appreciation because there was a moment in all that madness where it was like, "Oh my God, are we ever gonna get to tour again?" You yeah. know, like, will we be too old by the time this thing clears up? But we we got to, and the fans were amazing, and just the response was awesome, and it was a beautiful experience. So, thanks, and I missed you guys. Hugs and kisses. Yeah. Also, I just realized, Samus A, the the loading thing, it's an anagram for A am sus. A stands for Aaron. <laughs> <laughs> it's lovely to have you here, Gerard. Thank you. It's been many years. I think I think like 2015, 2016, last oh time I was God. on I was here on Grubs. For Sanic. For Sanic, yeah. Let's let's fucking what what are we playing today? We are playing Super Metroid. Japanese text, Japanese text. No, I don't understand it. <laughs> <laughs> Let me just make sure my controllers are good to go. The yeah. only thing I can read in that little line of text is Supa. Which means super. Thank you. <laughs> So you guys have played <laughs> Super Metro before on the channel, right? We did. Great, this one's a little bit different, so... Did we play it? We did, Aaron. Do really? you all remember that? Oh, we did. Uh, geez. Was there like a famous joke from that one? It's like 45 episodes I know, of our but lives. did we say anything of note? I mean, I, I remember it. What are the memes? The, the thing I remember most is... I was telling a story about my friend Joe and I, um... Smoking weed in our hometown, and, uh, these kids from a nearby school like, started coming up to a fence, like, to see us, uh -huh. and then another kid ran up to them and was like, those No, are... don't! Those are bad guys! <laughs> yeah. We were like, we're not- oh, man! <laughs> Maybe we are! No, no we were just hanging great. out! We just have long hair! Well, hold on, it's, it's been like three minutes now. This is a randomizer. Yes! What does is... that mean? All of the items are completely mixed up. Oh. So, we're either going to beat the game very quickly, or it's going to take a little longer. Okay. <laughs> so, um, I think the first item is guaranteed, though, so we will get, this will be the only item that is uh, in the same place. Oh, you always get the rolly oh, ball. You always ball. get the rolly ball. I, I chose a, a easier difficulty, or a normal difficulty, because I don't know, <laughs> I didn't want this to be like a 50-hour playthrough. Well, you literally can't do anything if you don't have the morph ball, right? Right, but there are there are definitely some randomizers that are like, you'll get the morph ball eventually. Can you glitch through all of this? Yeesh. What the hey? Yeah. Can you glitch through some of it? I, I know some glitches, and I'll show them off today as best I can. That's so, so cool. Yeah. So, yeah, I like the coolest. <laughs> it's so weird to have someone in this channel who can play video games. Yeah, so this is this, this is usually a missile upgrade. Okay. Yeah. And we got the power bomb, which okay. you get in the middle of the game. Perfect. Okay, cool. So, so we can power bomb through a bunch of stuff. Yeah, we can we can do some some great sequence breaking and uh Wreck and, and get some fun stuff early on. I'm gonna power bomb through this toilet trip. <laughs> this toilet ship, <laughs> did you say? No trip. I gotta oh, take a trip to the toilet. Oh yeah. I was trying to think of the most efficient way to let it out, but how often do you talk about pooping on this show? Aaron? Like uh, literally every. More episode. often yeah. than not, yeah. actually, I would oh, say. Oh, there's the charge beam. Oh shit. Let's see if I can try and. I don't have the high jump boots, so I can't grab it. But oh, and we got a super missile. Sick. <laughs> Is that what we were supposed to get earlier? No, it's supposed to be a, a regular missile. Oh. Uh, let's see. Can okay. you even get super missiles right now? Not for a while. No, I'm gonna try. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can do this. I'm gonna. No, stop it. Come back. Dude, you're like right there. Yes! Yeah! Yeah, yeah. He's right through it. Wow. So now you get the charge beam. From the knockback of getting hit? Yeah. What the hell is wrong with you? <laughs> <laughs> okay. Where did you learn this? Thanks, disgusting Dude. bug monster. I, pl I play. This is, this is a game that I probably play on Twitch a little too much. Uh, whenever I can't stream once in a blue moon. Twitch.io? Yeah. 
Twitch.io. Yeah, that's where you download all the games, right? Yeah, the free games on Twitch.io. Yeah. Wait, why are you still in here? So, I'm gonna try and do a, a, a really difficult, uh, skip right here. Or rather, yeah, he's gonna so, do one try. I'm gonna try and do this. If we can... Oh, come on, I can do this. There we go, there we go, there we go. Oh my god. Uh -huh, uh -huh. There we go. That's blown up there. And now, now I'm gonna try and get... I'm gonna... Come on. He's making art right now. <laughs> I, I, it really is like watching an artist at work. Come on, come on, come on! There we go. Oh, gross. Okay. So, wait, you, where are you now? Uh, we're headed to what's called in the speedrunning world the Billy Mays room, and you'll see why in a second. Uh, but usually, you need the high jump boots, and you need uh, the 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 at least the various suit to get through the water. So I'm gonna try my best to just like run my ass through this, and I. Uh, but you only have 99 energy. I know it's a risk. I made it. Okay. What oh the my god. What? So, this is the- what's called the Billy Mays room because- Oh, but wait, there's more. Oh, wait, there's more. Uh. <laughs> there's another power up in this room that people often forget about. Uh, and it's right here, and it is... Our first regular missile. Oh. Good God, yeah. man. We're off to a pretty great start. I have a good feeling about this run. Dang, this is exciting. Yeah, it's, it's gonna take off real, real quick. Yeah. Uh, but hopefully I don't die, cause I'm I- I'm good in NUT! <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, I just had to get that out of my system. <laughs> oh, 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 come on! Oh, oh, Ugh, this is- Are this you is, stuck? Uh... There we go. Oh, okay. of course you're not stuck. <laughs> <laughs> I you're have a good feeling about this Did you want me to be here. stuck? Oops! <laughs> <laughs> you're a fucking savant, dude. Look at this. Except you're also good at other things. <laughs> 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 yeah, that's true. I would spend like years doing something like this and getting like moderately okay at it and then failing when I actually record it on Game Grumps, but claiming I do better at home. Yeah, we're like the- <laughs> we're the types of savants that aren't good at the one thing. <laughs> <laughs> I'm really good at not being good at anything. <laughs> I'm a savant. One thing I've learned is that when you have a dumb name with the completionist, everyone expects success 24-7. Mm-hmm. So eventually I just became that. I just said, alright, fine, I'll do whatever you guys think I should be. That's brilliant. Uh, it's very exhausting. Another <laughs> missile? Oh yeah. What well, a waste. I know, that's- this- this- this is usually a power bomb, but, uh, at least we got that going Oh, you for have us. it. Are you going back up the elevator? I am. Dude, check this out, watch this, watch this. Look, do it. The shoulders, they look like when you're doing like a- like a face on your fist, you know, when you oh, do like, like a, a little, little mouth. <laughs> yeah, and like 90s. Hey guys, watch yeah. out! <laughs> that's what it, the shoulders look like. Now I can't unsee it. <laughs> I it look like power suits wah, 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 from the eighties. <laughs> so classic, the shoulder pads. Love oh them. yeah, you gotta you gotta get those big shoulders. That's how you look important and professional. I, yeah, I hope that comes back, man. Honestly, why don't you just bring it back, dude? Yeah, you're not like a Dick setter. Tracy villain. <laughs> <laughs> hey, watch out! Oh dang, I don't have the power bombs, so I can, I'm out of power bombs. I'll have to come back for this. There's a there's usually a missile upgrade down there, but now, uh, now that you have the power bomb, but out of order, are enemies gonna give you power bombs? Yes, they will, okay. but only only certain. Uh, enemies give you power bombs, so oh, so like, not, I, not I, these fucking wall chozos. Yeah, I'll literally farm these guys for days, and they won't give a shit. I can I can swear here, right? No, this well, is I a just swear free zone. Well, I know. I mean, I know it's a, I know it's a Christian channel, so I'm trying. Yeah. To Except for, yeah. <laughs> we only talk about Jesus on this channel. <laughs> The fact that you've been talking about Metroid is really fucking with yeah. our whole- I mean, it's messing with our- <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to, uh, welcome to Holy Grumps, everyone. <laughs> Holy Grumps! <laughs> oh my god. Oh my- that would be so funny. <laughs> if just, like, we take two weeks off and then come back super religious. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know what happened, man, I just- I went yeah. to Des Moines, Iowa, and yeah. <laughs> I, I got it. All gamers I mean, are going to hell. It yeah. just clicked for me. You no, know, so that makes sense, actually. <laughs> I, I do believe that, though. I do believe all gamers are going to hell, regardless <laughs> of if I'm religious or not. It's just a fact. You don't make up the rules. That's just how it goes. It's, I mean, it's just yeah. it's just life. Yeah. If you commit to the gaming lifestyle, you gotta yeah, pay the consequences, yeah, you gotta, man. With a capital G, if you're a gamer. <laughs> Your actions have consequences! <laughs> Wait, where are you going? I was just saving to get my power bombs back so we can, <clears throat> oh, we can continue the game breaking you aspect clever, of it. Clever, clever man. I, yeah. I'm gonna be honest. Yeah. I don't even think I knew you could do that. No. You could, oh, <laughs> go and get get full health from the ship? Yeah. I retroactively understand all the frustration at our previous playthrough. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I, I don't know, I played this as a kid and then later as an adult and never looked up any documentation about it, so. Yeah. 
It just it just was what it was to me at that time and forever. Yeah. Yeah, Metroid was one of those games you just kind of go and like you're very blind to a lot of it. Yeah. I mean, the fact that you like blew up a wall and found a fucking crescent moon, I was like, well, that's news to me. And, <laughs> and we're not even like a minute into the fucking episode. When you killed the um the slow moving shrimpy things that like are generally just used for like freezing and <gasps> and use them as platforms. Oh man! Oh, greater than sign. So speed or <laughs> speed boost. We get this <laughs> usually midway sign. through the game. <laughs> oh, what was that? This is the speed boost. Uh huh. Oh, and I guess in this version they turn off the boss. Uh, speed boost you get very uh, towards the middle of the game. You can kind of do this cool thing now. I don't know if it's gonna work because we're in the room, but. <laughs> oh, cool. Also, I'd like you to know that I forgot the ending to what I was gonna say before, oh, but so I did sorry. have a point. That's it. <laughs> I didn't know you could kill those things. Oh, the little floaty things? Yeah, the little floaty things. The, the little, um, croissants? Yeah, maybe maybe I did eventually from our last playthrough, but I always just thought of them as, like, indestructible, indestructible. things. Yeah. They're little platforms. You can freeze them and that, then yeah, jump on them. That, that's what I remember about them. Oh, is this the run room? Uh, not yet. Uh, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Welcome to our lives. <laughs> that one's gonna stink. <laughs> Aaron, you're incorrect. Ooh, super missile. Is gonna implies <laughs> that it will start at some later point. <laughs> it was instantaneous. Oh man, I had one of those recently. I was like with a bunch of people I really like, and then I burped, and then they were like, oh man, and I was like, I'm so sorry. Yeah. <laughs> if it Dude. was a fart, I wouldn't care, because that's hilarious, but burps are disgusting. Is that really how you feel? You think you think burps are worse than farts? Yeah, because farts are funny. I'm gonna go ahead and put you in the minority. Burps, <laughs> burps are like uh, they're not funny. They're just like oh god. Yeah, well you can burp and people go oh you know, like excuse me and be like oh no worries. But when you fart, it's no like, no. I'm talking about the smell. Oh the smell. Okay. You also have a shocking love for ass things. <laughs> yeah, of course. Like well, who doesn't? Well, I mean <laughs> most. Everybody loves a good ass. <laughs> Everybody was getting all upset that Mario in the Mario movie didn't have a butt, so... There you go. Well, I think they're mad because the Illumination movies, all the minions have big butts. So it's like, why didn't they just apply the same logic? Yeah, why didn't they give Mario fucking sweet cakes, man? Boy, I've- <laughs> I've missed this Mario isn't caked up controversy that apparently <laughs> is raging. Yes. Yeah, uh, it, well, it's important. I mean, that's why Peach baked him a cake, because he needs one. Oh. <laughs> Wow. Yeah, all all the context we need for so Mario many layers. Brothers. I know, I like a cake <laughs> that Mario doesn't have. Are we at Mother Brain right now? What are you, Gerard? You are fucking killing this. <laughs> no, so that you're actually right. This is Mother Brain from the original Metroid One. It, yeah, it looks like her lair. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, but there's a secret item underneath her uh, from where she used to be. So Wait, really? Uh, yeah. So it's you. All the, most of the stuff we've gotten is usually. Missiles. It's I like I didn't even fucking put that together. No, because oh, like this original. whole climb is in the original game, right? Yeah, this yeah. is this is the exit sequence, which when is great because when you beat this game, it's also the same exit exit sequence. Oh, I love it. Yeah, that was one of the most stressful and thrilling experiences as a kid that I ever had. Trying to fucking after you kill Mother Brain and then you're frantically trying to get out before the planet explodes. Yeah, oh, the freaking Ridley music of dun 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 dun, dun is like yeah. the most stressful. Thing ever just run your ass off. I also, I didn't. I'm sorry. I'm no, just very ahead. excited. I just didn't realize how long, like, or how much this is a Giger painting. This whole game. <laughs> oh yeah. It's really really cool. This and Contra is just like. Oh, Contra is so up. so Giger. Mm -hmm. There's they're gonna have a a pop up museum of Giger of original Giger paintings, uh, in Hollywood in November. Dude, what if we kissed at the Giger museum? Aaron. <laughs> First of all, awesome. <laughs> Secondly, yeah. <laughs> well, I'm glad that's settled. All right. Dope. I was going to say when you were climbing, you were talking about stressful game experiences. I was going to say the most stressful game experience for me was trying to land the plane in Top Gun for the NES. Oh, oh you and geez. everyone, man. That plane was awful. It was just like, up, up, down, down, up. And you're like, ah, I'm doing all the things you're telling me to do. Nice save, dude. Oh, I didn't save, damn it. What? Why? I pressed the key. Sometimes I forget which button's which. <laughs> like, the, the buttons in this game 
change depending on what menu you're in and whatnot. You know the map so well that you can fucking get <laughs> items out of order and break the sequence, and yet you don't know the controller buttons? I just, they change sometimes, man. <laughs> <laughs> Mm. Oh, A! <laughs> That's the jump button. That's the one. That's the one that am sus, though. So. <laughs> totally sus. Makes sense. Where are you going now? Oh, I, I was wondering when you were going to do this. Yeah. So we've, we've, we've basically cleared out this opening area. We're now going to head to Brinstar. Uh, Good God. Oh, and, nice. uh... Yeah, we're gonna pl just kind of work our way through it. The hey, this is actually a proper item, energy tank. This oh, okay. is where you usually get it, so that didn't randomize. Wow. So, it. thanks for not randomizing game. Yeah. It's good, we needed that though, right? Oh, definitely, I definitely could've used that. Yeah. Welcome to the Mushroom Kingdom, dude. <laughs> That's what you say every time you unzip your pants. <laughs> <laughs> Hail to the king, baby. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Look at those giant mushrooms. They're they're hilarious. Do they have spines? The small ones look like they have spines. They they definitely look like living creatures. Mm -hmm. What's the lore here? What is this planet? It's where the Chozo live? Come is from? it really? I think so. I don't know. I don't the first Metroid game, I Zero Mission definitely explains everything a, a bit better because they you know, retroactively made the oh, yeah, game. Right. Like, oh, yeah. The first that? Metroid game almost like it's it's weirdness and mystery was kind <laughs> of like part of the appeal. Yeah. Because just you had no idea what was happening. Yeah. Yeah. Chozo sounds delicious in a taco. Yeah. <laughs> oh, the can I get that with Chozo? <laughs> <laughs> Instead of the seasoned beef, can I get Chozo, please? <laughs> Thank you. And you know that one person's like, it's chorizo, actually. <laughs> <laughs> That's gonna happen. Oh, they absolutely. already typed it and submitted it, and yeah. then you called them out, and they're like, "Fuck!" They're trying to find out <laughs> how to delete it. it, but it's so buried in other comments. <laughs> mm. Oh, I missed you, monster! Shut up! <laughs> <laughs> Don't put that in. Put that out. <laughs> it's a bad habit. Nobody likes it. I've never seen anyone tell themselves to shut up. It's just a poison, man. It's just poison. I'm yeah. putting that out in the world that it's okay to drink poison. It's not. <laughs> Children, don't do it. Tons of influencers do that already, Aaron. I'm, a, I'm one of them, so it's, it's a really fine. bad idea. Well, <laughs> this is... I mean, this is poison to the nth degree. Like, it's got so much shit in it. Like, listen to this. How many of these ingredients do you recognize? Um... Inositol. Do you know what that is? No clue. Do you know what D-glu-D-glucuronolactone is? Sounds like gum. These nuts of glucuronolactone. <laughs> <Don't. laughs> <laughs> <laughs> Yo, can we get like some air horn sounds out? <laughs> burr, burr, burr. <laughs> just the fucking deal with it glasses come down <laughs> on something. I don't know what it would come down on. Cyanocobalamin. That's pretty good. <laughs> Corona, California? What the fuck is that? Oh, you, can't, you can't say that word. <laughs> <laughs> so right. <laughs> There's more taurine in this than there is caffeine. That's strange. I didn't expect that. I've actually never looked at the ingredients list for monsters, so now I'm kinda... kinda very interested in this. It's... It sounds like the same ingredients as, like, the little houses they make for roaches. <laughs> you know, <laughs> that, like, they can't get out of. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Wow. Okay, so I'm gonna- I'm gonna- I don't know if I can do this. This might be a trap. Jeez, man. Oh, not recommended okay. for children, people sensitive to caffeine, pregnant women, or women who are nursing. God, can you imagine getting some, like, titty milk that's, like, filled with monsters? <laughs> 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 the kid's like, what is this? <laughs> this is not what I requested. <laughs> <They're> like, <laughs> 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 Lift its crib and throws it across the room. Ah, shit. The fucking thumb is just a skeleton. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you, man. Do you want to get eaten by that thing? No, I, I messed up. I, I was supposed to jump and I, I got too hype and I fell through the hole. Damn, fucking hype beast over here. It's okay. We'll I can't believe you fell through the floor that looks like every other part of the floor. <laughs> yeah, right. Get it together, Gerard. <laughs> I just saved the game, so if I die, it's fine. Okay, cool. I thought you were the completer. There we go. Yeah. <laughs> you say that, and I'm like, uh-huh, and I go home, and I, like, 
whip myself and like <laughs> get better, get better, get better. Oh man, that's all of us, man. <laughs> Aaron doubts you get better. <laughs> Anybody that puts themselves in the public eye's got a little bit of that in them. <laughs> This is where you're supposed to learn how to d double jump here, or try yep. a triangle jump, or whatever the fuck it's yeah, called. Yeah, those, those little guys are trying to show me how oh. to do it. Oh. Super missiles are so boring! <laughs> Give us fucking laser beams or whatever. I know, we've only got the charge beam so far. What about the Varia suit? I hope we get stuff. If we don't get enough suits, I'm gonna get- we're gonna get real- I'm gonna get real nervous real quick. <laughs> Cause that's like the one of the few game breaking items is the suits. If you don't have the suit, you can't progress to like oh, half yeah. the game. Mm. You know what I've heard about that suit? Mm. It's very uh. <laughs> what? Because <laughs> it's the various. Oh, suit. got it. <laughs> <laughs> In retrospect, I feel like I should have been able to pick up on that. You know, it's it's if we put out fucking thirty minutes of content every day, you're just gonna throw it against the wall. Yeah, yeah. One of them's gonna stick. Yeah. yeah. You gotta figure something out. Yeah. And then and then you get and then we make like a compilation of like best moments ever. And it's like these guys are so fucking funny. Hilarious. It's like ten minutes Meanwhile, of like ten I can years say of one, content. <laughs> one funny thing every seven episodes, I consider it a huge victory. <laughs> <laughs> what is the spring ball? You can jump when you're in spring. Oh, oh that's oh, sick, nice. dude. You're a little ball hopping yeah, up and down. It's an end game item. Oh, that yeah, it feels like it. Yeah. <laughs> Uh, a lot of chaos happening on the screen when you jump up and down in your little ball. <laughs> Can't you just do that anyway with your bombs? Uh, yeah, but it's like real hard because you have to time them perfectly and... Yeah, but you could do it. I could do it, yeah. So fucking what's the problem? There's no, there's well, no the problem. The problem is most people are mere mortals. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so I have I'm, empathy I, for those people. I have a question for you guys. Yeah. Do you want me to just do this section that we have the the speed booster, or do you want me to show you, like the glitch that we can that that theoretically would we would we would need to do if we didn't get the speed booster? Baby, I want you to think of I want to, I want you to think with your entertainment brain. Okay, <laughs> then I will show you the the cool the cool skip right here. Hell yeah. Nice. So the speed booster uh, is one of the important items in the game that lets you like. Run through walls, like, <laughs> jump up through certain areas, mm -hmm. uh, and in this case, uh, in Brinstar, you technically like you can complete all of Brinstar except for like two or three areas because you need suits or you need the speed booster. So in this room specifically, I'll show you real quick. Um, if you run through this area, yeah. you don't have the speed boost, you fall right through, and then that kind of goes down through. You're like, oh dang, that sucks. I can't. I, I need the speed booster. Um, but what you can do, and I don't know, I'm gonna try my best to do it. Show off my true gamer capital G skill. Turn off the speed booster. Um, is if you jump, turn the ball as you're in the air. Up, oh, no, I almost had it. As you're in the air, uh, on the last frame, you turn into a ball and hold right. You'll maintain your momentum, and you can just beeline to the right and make it through. Get out of here. What the so, hey? Yeah, so I'm gonna try. I I got close, but I messed it up. It's all it's a very uh, specific frame, so I'm gonna try to do it uh, for you guys. All right, right everyone now. at home, scroll forward to see how long it oh, takes. Oh no, <laughs> no, no! <laughs> and then when you come back, let us know. You say, oh, you guys are in for the long haul. <laughs> no, no, don't don't do that to me, Aaron. <laughs> all right, let's see. Uh, I bonked my head. Stop go texting me. Who the fuck is texting me? Uh, I messed me. it up. I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, I'm doing a show. <laughs> I'm sorry. I just wanted to talk about other shit. <laughs> this is Gerard guy. <laughs> <laughs> this guy's totally showing us up on our own channel. Do, do you know him? Or? Damn it. <laughs> My, do you know it? <laughs> How do you get in the building? <laughs> okay, so I can't- I don't- I ran out of power bombs, I don't want to waste too much time, so I'll just do it the old-fashioned way. Okay. God, we had that happen once. We had a- oh man. <laughs> nice. I don't know if I should tell that. Yeah, it's fine. We, we just had like a lady show up to our office, and she just like came in and started watering our plants. She was just some nice lady who walks around the neighborhood and waters <laughs> the plants. Are you serious? It's <laughs> just like walked in. And she was like, hi, I'm watering plants. And then she just watered our plants and then left. And she came it. into the building or just in the outside? Yeah, she just came into the building. You guys just let her in? <laughs> yeah, she's just a nice little old lady. 
<laughs> I mean, I wouldn't have let her in, but I, I hate nice old ladies. <laughs> it's not my thing. That is bizarre. Yeah. Everyone was like, hi, who are you? <laughs> I love that you gave her the wavery voice, like, hey! <laughs> Yeah, I, I, came really, to, I, I came to- I came to water your plants! Story. <laughs> what the hell, dude? You're just- you're making stuff up! <laughs> I know, that's crazy. You know what that voice is, Aaron, uh, that I freaking love what you do? Uh, Remember when we played Family Feud, and it's like the girl next to the guy with the weird, like, fox head? And she- She says everything like this, like... <laughs> Alright, here, here's the scene. The scene was, the- the guy's asking the fox head guy a question. And he's and the fox head guy goes off on a tangent. And he's like, mm, mm, "I I wish I could have ten puppies. I could have eight, but my vestigial extra two nipples wouldn't do the trick." And then the guy's like, <laughs> uh, "Anyway," and the woman next to him just answers the question like, "Computer." <laughs> <laughs> Answer. Good answer. Good answer. Good answer. Good number one. <laughs> like your favorite moments of all time. <laughs> Come <get it. laughs> I love this show. <laughs> oh man. Sorry to be so self-referential, -refer Gerard. That's okay. No, it's fine. Yeah. I've yeah. watched enough game groups to know. So oh, you gave, him, you gave him fucking joy in that moment, dude. You don't <laughs> have to apologize. I laughed. Yeah. It was funny. Um, I can't believe how fucking far we are in this game. You've been playing this for 26 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, so this is Mother Brain. <laughs> <laughs> um, I think yeah. we'd figured out how to open so doors I by need, this point. Need, <laughs> okay, so usually you need the, um, the grapple beam to get across this. Right, 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 right. We're gonna not need that. But I'm just gonna press the I'm flying button. There yep, you go. There we go. <laughs> <laughs> Good for you, man. <laughs> you can always do that, right? Like, from the beginning? Yeah. Yeah, there's no- we haven't done any- any glitches. It's all just been... Just pure talent, Aaron! I mean, I guess they just assumed that the triangle jump would be so hard to do for- for people, because it is. Yeah. For me. I suck at that shit. That's the problem, man. Like, you're making this look so easy, I'm starting to think, like, I could do this. <laughs> <laughs> like, when you watch, like, like an Olympic snowboarder do the half pipe, and you're like, Oh yeah, I think I could, I could yeah. take up snowboarding, no problem. Yeah, you hey, just give me go a couple up, yeah. you just <laughs> twist, and that's it. It can't be that hard. S stick the landing, <laughs> loser. <laughs> oh, you got little piddly bombs now. Yeah, uh, that area where we usually... You have to get that that bomb. You get the bomb but one of the first things, but like I said, we were lucky that we had the uh, the speed booster, or I could glitch through it. But we ended up getting the power bomb or the normal bomb. So nice. Everything's just coming up Millhouse right now. What the fuck was I talking about when you got the little piddly bomb? I didn't see. Oh, it doesn't matter. I'm so fucking blazing through this. Ah, oh, so boring. Energy <laughs> takes boring. <laughs> get get the fucking ray gun or whatever. I know. I want the plasma beam. We get the plasma beam and this game over. Everyone will die in like two hits. Uh, so there's another item down there that we can't quite get right now. Why? Uh, we need the. Uh, <laughs> Explain to me. I got you. Yeah. I got you. We Give need me a the good fucking reason. <laughs> <laughs> we need the. Uh, what's it called? Uh, we need the uh, various suits. So we can run through water. Oh. Because uh, you have to run through the whole of section. Course. But I'm gonna try so and see if I can run through water. No. <laughs> <laughs> Did you catch that? <laughs> I've never felt more inadequate. <laughs> <laughs> so this this room uh, has a particular. You have you have to have uh, the I think it's the plasma beam or one of the beam the wave beam like lets you go through. Um. The walls, so you can like uh, just shoot the switch on the other side. But if I can, if I somehow like can jump at the same time like this, see how the missile's like kind of hitting that that square block? Uh huh. If I can jump and barely shoot it up, it'll go through the door and open it. So I'm gonna try and do it. Although I'm sucking really bad right now. Dude, you're gonna run out of super missiles. What are you gonna do? Uh, that, was that I, it? God, you're embarrassing that was, yourself. That I am. <laughs> that was it, but I didn't hear it make the noise. I, we might have to come back. Yeah, I'll have to come back. Yeah, you need the the beam to shoot through that so you can get to the other side. And there's some items there. 
Bro! I'm sorry, guys. I'm really messing up the glitches right now. I'm fucking right disappointed, now. honestly. Are we even gonna release this episode now? <laughs> <laughs> Cut. <laughs> mm. uh, sorry, I'm just drinking my poison. <laughs> poison? I'm offsetting it by working out, so it's like, I work out, I add a year to my life, I drink a can of fucking- You lose three? Blue poison. <laughs> yeah. yeah. <laughs> Just mitigating. Every monster I drink, I eat a celery stick. <laughs> <laughs> Cancels out. Celery burns calories when you eat it, so... <laughs> you have to eat, like, 30 sticks of celery to burn off one monster. Yeah, well, this is the- this is the zero-calorie monster. Ah. Well, it has 30 calories, but, you know. Same thing. You know what also doesn't have any calories? Mm. Rat poison. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, not true. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I can tell you from experience, I got fat on rat poison. Yeah. <laughs> I call it fat poison. <laughs> oh, oh, you gotta fight God. a boss now? God, we're here? Yeah. It took us so long to get to this guy. I love his stupid little mouth. I think, isn't he an eye? Yeah, but it looks like a mouth right now. Oh, yeah. Be, be, be. Is it? I've always thought it was a mouth. It might be. Cause what is- Oh no, it is a mouth, yeah. Cause that thing, yeah. Unless it's three eyes in one, which is kinda creepy. No, for some reason I remembered it as being a giant eyeball when it opens. Yeah, like, just like a Shumagorath kinda. Yeah. Dun, 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 Come dun, on! Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> yeah, what's the- what is the lore behind him just like opening up? Why doesn't he just stay like this forever? He's also like, what is he doing? Is, is it just to breed? Cause he's, he's like shooting out these little spores, Yeah, I think but... he's pollinating. <sighs> You mean there's another one of these? There's a female one of these? <laughs> <laughs> hey, boys! He like, shoot, he like shoots out receptors, like catches. Where are you going with that stamen? <laughs> <laughs> wow. So this is the room that you're supposed to... You, when you kill him, you get the, the super missiles. Oh. So this is normal, so we actually kill him faster because we already had them. Which is that's, nice. That's fucking sick, dude. Yeah, dude. That's pretty good. See, like... You know that feeling of like nostalgia when you like see a sprite and you're like, I know that sprite from childhood. Yeah. Every time you do the wall jump, it's like, it's like a new game that I've never seen before. Because <laughs> that little frame of her like hanging on the wall for a second, I'm like, what the fuck is that? Yeah. So I never use that shit. Yeah. There's like, if you're playing the game straight, there's just like the one part that you have to use it, right? There's actually, I don't, th there's a, if you trap yourself with those, with the little aliens, that's like the only required part. Yeah. Where you have to do it. Um, and it's crazy to think about because it's, it's a tutorial section. It's like, this is how you do this. Yeah. And it doesn't tell you how to do it. You just have to look at these little alien guys run around. Well, cause <laughs> they didn't, I, I get what they were going for. And yeah. like, in, in theory, that's a really fun way to explain it to the player, but there's like no other thing in the entire game that, where uh, a, yeah. like a little enemy shows you how to do something. Yeah. So you're just kind of like, oh, look at these funny little creatures. Yeah. What are they doing? How the fuck do I get out of here? <laughs> also, this is a dumb secret. Mmm. Nice. You're supposed to know that because it doesn't shoot enemies out. Uh, so it's like, why, 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 why do all these ones constantly shoot enemies, but that one doesn't? That's a friendly pipe. That's fun. Yeah. A friendly pipe. <laughs> friendly pipe. <laughs> That's ah. where my sewage gets carried somewhere. <laughs> I don't know where, nor do I care. Do you think, like, 30 years from now, long after Game Grumps is done, we'll look back on this time of our lives and, like, We'll get nostalgic when people call us idiots because we got so used to it during this section of our lives. <laughs> <laughs> Someone will be like, you idiot, and we'll be like, aww, wow. I remember that. Feels like past traumas. 2021. <laughs> and 22. Oh. And also the previous eight years before that. <laughs> Day one. <laughs> wow. <laughs> Okay, so usually speaking, uh, we have to go down through Norfair, get the high jump boots, get the ice beam, and then you can come back this way and, and continue. Uh, we're gonna just get some items without that, because we can do the cool jumping stuff. Got it. So we're gonna try our best to, uh... That's what I thought you were gonna do, honestly. I was actually surprised you didn't do it yet. <laughs> gotcha. I was thinking to gotcha. myself. I just didn't want to say anything. Yeah, wow, yeah. he's going real slow with this. You're right, you're right. I didn't want to backseat you. <laughs> <laughs> but well, here we are. 
it embarrassed me enough to. <laughs> I cringed. <laughs> Oh. I felt so superior yeah. <laughs> that I felt secondhand embarrassment for you. Yeah, we don't even Let's need a Game Grumps can... cringe compilation. Just put this episode on. <laughs> <laughs> I cringed is such a great review sentence for anything, which mm -hmm. is like not doesn't need to make sense at all. Yeah. Well, there's such a there's such a feeling of like superiority to saying it. You know? Yeah, yeah. Like I'm so above this that God, I just I just wish I could. I just oh. feel bad for everyone involved. <laughs> Beatles, I'm so good. Beatles, the White Album. I cringed. <laughs> <laughs> Two out of ten. Thinking about the Beatles, knowing about the verbiage of cringing makes me, <laughs> makes me cringe. Oh, I cringed. <laughs> oh. John. John. John's cringing. <laughs> Ringo, stop cringing on the drums. <laughs> <laughs> Stop cringing on the drums. <laughs> hey, hey, there we go. Really impressive. Mama fucking Mia, dude. That's a Lord. spicy meatball. Damn, yo, what the fucking my phone's blowing up. I hope somebody's gonna die. Hold on. <laughs> I hope somebody isn't die. Yeah. <laughs> so much shit. Okay, it's not. It's it's work stuff. Was it you, Allie? <laughs> yeah, she just oh, leaned over and did a <laughs> Well, it's also other work stuff. Oh, okay. It's not just that one. I understand. It's a Monday, so everyone's like taking care of all the shit that like backed up on the weekend. Right. So, I need this now! <laughs> I didn't do it Friday! <laughs> God, that bomb's really powerful. Feels like you shouldn't have it yet. <laughs> <laughs> So actually, it's funny you say that because uh, in a normal run that's not randomized, I could I just secret break that right. This is where you would get the power bomb early. Really? Yeah. So we'd be getting it right now. Okay. Cool. But we got it super early. It's instead. just crazy impressive. I don't even know where you are. Right? Like, what planet are you on? <laughs> the same one. Oh, is it all the same planet? <laughs> yeah. Oh, it's just like different areas of. Yeah. The planet. That's cool. Little biomes. Yeah. So this is technically, I think we're in. This is. Brinstar still, yeah. Okay, cool. Cause I, I, I like that when, like, sci-fi acknowledges that planets are, like, diverse. Cause like in Star Wars, when it's like, they go to Coruscant or whatever, and it's like, this is the city planet. And it's like, so, are there, like, other things on the planet? No, it's just all city. <laughs> it's just okay. all one big city. The whole planet. This, I mean, this is why, like, it is all based on aliens. Like, the reason they made, um, oh my god, I'm fucking blanking on her name. R Ridley, uh, Sigourney Ripley. Weaver, Ripley, Ripley, Ripley. R Ridley is a character in this game. That was sort inspired. Of, yeah, I was yeah, just getting yeah, that, yeah, like yeah. my wires and, crossed. And Samus. All I could think of was <laughs> Helen of Troy. Like, That's <laughs> definitely not right. Uh, <laughs> Hel Helen of Troy is the new genre of Metroidvania. I love yeah. it. <laughs> that's that's the sign of a stroke, actually. When <laughs> think of Helen of Troy. Yeah, all the uh, all the facts. That I've learned in my life are like blending together. <laughs> oh god. I mean, yeah. I feel that every day. Helen of Troy is the Metroidvania that is the movie tie in with the movie Troy starring Brad Pitt. Oh god, you were thinking Dude. of Troy because of Metroid. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> yes. God, that's brilliant. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Aaron. <laughs> Your brain is awesome. <laughs> what a creative force. Oh, bad. Really try to channel my dementia <laughs> <laughs> into something cool and constructive. <laughs> <laughs> Can I be as funny without the dementia? This, I don't know. <laughs> this room is always the creepiest because you get here and it's all very, very geekery, right? And then you're like, what's in this room? And then you just fall through this like weird chamber and there's a power up. You get sucked that into the bizarre. plant. Yeah. So, what is it like? Have roots or no or I have I I wish I could tell you. It just feels like feels like an oversight. Oh, you get sucked into a plant, whatever. Do you get gooey? I don't know. Uh, <laughs> it's yeah, who, a hole. Yeah, who cares? <laughs> <laughs> That's how I view this world. <laughs> a series of holes. <laughs> wow, Aaron. <laughs> <laughs> I was a character, that wasn't me. It was the designer of the game. <laughs> I don't view this world as a series of holes. <laughs> I used to. I have to go pee. Mm -hmm. <laughs> does it? Does anyone care? So go. No, you don't mind. No, man, we're fucking forty right. minutes in. Yeah, who, who cool. cares, man? This is Gerard just... and I'll just like 
talk a bunch of shit talk about, you. about about me. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> cool. Thanks. What are you, Matt Watson? Yeah. Freaking Matt and Ryan. I swear to God, it's because I never fight back that they're just like, cool. Let's go ham. <laughs> Freaking. They call. They told. <laughs> they were doing one of their like podcasty things, and they said I was a member of the Oath Keepers. <laughs> <laughs> what? <laughs> yeah. What is that? I believe it's a Nazi organization. <laughs> I'm not even entirely sure. But in any case, I was Jesus. like, there they are, up to their old shenanigans. <laughs> Nothing's changed. Yeah, and well. my my cousin, who, like, doesn't follow my career closely, but occasionally will, like, watch something that comes across the screen. Oh, He's boy. like, D are, did you, like, join the Oath Keepers? <laughs> <laughs> no! No, no. I'm like, Matt, Ryan, this is why... Like, you can't say shit like this. Some people don't know that we're friends and you're kidding. <laughs> they, uh... Yeah, they have, a, they have a lore about everyone. Brent doesn't wash his penis. Yeah. And, uh, I have a huge bong collection. I um, honestly have to say, I think you got off easy. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> when compared to everybody else's... Yeah, I guess that's true. <laughs> Even if I did have a huge bong collection, I'd be like, Check out my bongs, dude! Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Awesome. Yeah, and nowadays no one would care. Yeah, seriously. <laughs> Weren't you gonna go pee? You don't even need to say water pipes anymore. I really have to pee. Yeah, no. go. Okay, okay, go I'll, I'll be right back. I won't kill- go pee? We have a lot of shit to do. I won't- I won't kill any bosses while you're gone. Thank you, Gerard. Yeah, no problem. Right, see you in a sec. So, Gerard. Dude, you hear about Dan being in the Oath Keepers? It's kind of crazy. It's fucked up, yeah, man. Yeah, what the hell? I had no idea. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta start rethinking my career path here. Oh, seriously, man. Um, so anyway, Dan's a great guy. Missed him a lot. I, I kind of wanted to like, like turn the, flip the script a little bit and yeah. like, talk not trash on him while he's gone. Just like handsome boy, really nice, kind person. Uh, always funny on the show. Uh, why am I struggling to say nice things about Dan? <laughs> Well, I think I th your guys' friendship is so uh, fun to uh, to see all the time, just whether it's on Game Grumps or in person, just because, like, it really feels like you guys know each other for so, 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 so long. And, I mean, now that's true, but before even when you guys first started, it just, your guys' chemistry was just crazy high. Yes, yeah, it's, it's wild. We used to, um, from what I understand, <clears throat> when we were filming our YouTube Red show, um, which is great, by the way. Oh, thank you. Yeah. Um, we did our best. Uh, and there were a lot of very talented people on that team. Um, but, uh, apparently, we, it's, there was sort of a realization that when Dan and I were doing scenes together, it was just, like, fluid. Yeah. So they saved our scenes for last so that they could go, they could, like, spend a lot of time for... Everything else? Yeah, for like yeah. scenes that might go wrong or like they might need to change something or whatever yeah. so that like at the end of the day when we only have like 30 minutes left and like everyone wants to go home, they knew we were just gonna nail it. So, that was, that was cool to be like, oh yeah, we do have chemistry, that's interesting, cool. Yeah. Um, cause it was just so easy to play off each other cause we just do it every day. <laughs> yeah. So where are you now, Gerard? Uh, we're still on Brinstar. Ooh, the high oh, jump boots. Ooh, hello! Ooh, now we can jump high. Those look like they'd be heavy. Yeah, right? Like, I, why would they make you jump high? Also, higher? I don't know if the sprite changes. Maybe it changes? What, like, with I, the randomizer? Oh, no, just like the sprite itself. Like, I guess the... It's, no. It doesn't... It looks the Do same, they? right? Oh, no, no, let's take a look. I know in this menu it changes. Oh, because you can turn them off. Not. Nah, no, nah, the they look the same. Hey, Dan. Hi, guys. How's it going? Well, <laughs> you're going to be excited about the comments section for this video. Uh, nothing like returning to a room and feeling the eerie silence of people who had to stop their conversation <laughs> mid-sentence. I think we were talking about high jump boots when you walked in. Yeah, okay, cool. I just, I just got the high jump boots and we're about to go fight a boss. Oh, sweet. Oh, you're fighting a boss? Yeah, we're going to go fight Kraid. Yo, that's sick, dog. You guys know Kraid. We wrote a song about him. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah. Yeah, that was, that was nice. That was a good fun, yeah. fun little romp. Gerard, if we do another Starbomb album, would you like to be on it? Are you kidding me? In a heartbeat. Really? Yeah. He's got a whole album. Yeah. Multiple. You got an album? Yeah, Big Bad Bosses. Get out of here. Yeah, Aaron, uh, we, uh, I asked Aaron to do, like, a, a bit that's a, a parody of your guys' opening for the Starbomb album. Oh, it was supposed to be Aaron, like, 
roasting us and how we copied you guys and all this stuff. But then Aaron heard the album and instead made a really sweet, endearing intro. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wow, this is really good. It's supposed to be a bit about Starbomb, like, copying, but they really put the work in. And that's, yeah. great. <laughs> that's awesome. <laughs> yeah. We, um, we found, uh, you, you know how in the most recent Starbomb album, there's uh, that woman singing, Sexy music, sexy <laughs> yes. music. We, like, we found a, a, like a treasure trove of, uh, it's all royalty free. Yeah. So she must have just gotten paid like as a day player, and then they put that stuff out there. I'm sure she has no idea that she's on oh. the Starbomb <laughs> album, okay. and would not care either way. But um, we found a bunch of stuff that she sang yeah. that... Oh, it's the best. There's one that goes like, "Cover me with ice cream, yeah. me what? up and down." Well, because we were yeah. we were thinking of ways to when we were writing the Starbomb album, yeah. we found all of them, mm -hmm. and we were like trying to find other ways to put them in, but we yeah. were kind of like, "Nah, it's the funniest if it's just the one time." Oh, <laughs> but maybe with this next with album, ice cream. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> it's incredibly random. I fucking love that. Sexy music sets the mood, and then it's this fucking yeah. screaming. Dark fucking Souls. <laughs> <laughs> Chest is dripping with something I'm calling titty sauce. <laughs> <laughs> Did you just kill him? Did you just kill Craid? No, that was Mini Craid. Oh, baby, okay. baby Craid. Baby Craid. All right. That was that was that's a fake out. That was the Craid in the original Metroid looks like that. Right. That was. A cradlet. But then when you get to actual Kraid, mm. who's this guy? I think it's to show you that, like, he was someone who failed. Yeah, all, all who have tried this have not survived. Yeah, but, like, yeah. who is he? I thought you were <laughs> discovering he? <laughs> <laughs> What does he do? I thought you were discovering this for the first time as a whoever you are. Human? Are you a human? Is Samus a human? Oh, yeah. God. Or at least a, <laughs> and this is awesome. the, yeah. like, on the space <laughs> version of what a human is, or in the time. Yeah. Like. Yeah. Well, she was based on Ripley from from Alien. That, right, that, but you know I, th this game has its own lore. So. Right, right. I think she's just essentially the same type of character. <laughs> Gave her a voice in uh, Other M or whatever. Really? Yeah, she's like, "Hi, I'm Samus. I'm going on my mission," and it's like, "No, don't! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> <laughs> don't say things, please!" <laughs> wow, that's a very Godzilla-like. Scream. Is that Very a sample? Kaiju. That's gotta be a sample, right? I think it's- I don't think so. It sounds like elephant-y. Mm. Oh, God dang it. Okay. So this is where we would get the various suit, I believe. Oops. I, I always forget the name of- the red suit that makes you immune to fire. Uh, is that not the various suit? It's like the Fozo suit or something? Oh, there's the various suit- there's, there's, there's the two suits, the purple suit and the red suit. The dookie suit? Uh, <laughs> they compound together as one suit, but uh, we're about to enter Norfair without that suit, which uh, might cause some problems for us. Okay. I don't know. I think you got this. Have we gone sideways with like the randomizer <laughs> situation? It, yeah, it, it might get bad. <laughs> okay. It cool. might get bad. The fucking the fucking meta narrative of you like just running into people and exploding <laughs> them. I'm just imagining from the Chozo's perspective, they're like, meh, and they just see like. <laughs> <laughs> Just fucking running full speed. No! <laughs> Is that someone running up? <laughs> oh. Wow. I'm sick of all these fucking energy tanks and missiles. Look at how much energy you have. Nice. The, the <laughs> Got him. The, the thing that's crazy is that in the typical run, this game is loaded with regular missiles. Like, there's 235 regular missiles. The fact that we have 35 scares me because it just means that the item pool is soon going to be just just missiles, missiles. and uh, I'm very scared for that because then that means that th these next few areas are gonna suck a lot yeah but there's the same there's the same probability then of like getting another weapon like yeah it's really easy to get little missile upgrades right yeah we're, we're so I wouldn't be too worried yeah I'll, I'll I'll panic in a little bit or I'll save the panic uh, for later but I think we're we're getting there. Are this, those little guys are supposed to be on fire, right? I think so. That, that's what I always thought. But they just, they're not like, blo things aren't fire around them, so. Yeah. So they're generating their own fire? They're the real fireflies. Contained fire? <laughs> it's like a fire Pokemon that just like doesn't, like, Ponyta doesn't walk around and burn things, right? I feel like being able to generate fire with your body burns a lot of calories. 
Oh, absolutely. Like, you you would need to eat so much to keep, like, a fire burning on your body. Yeah. That's a great point. Okay, so this is where we usually get the high jump boots. Let's see what we get. Various suit. Reserve tank. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Reserve tank. Right. Mm. Well, I... How does it work it, when on a randomizer? Is it like all set up as soon as you start the game, or is it actually just cycling randomly through things endlessly? It's, it's all set up before the game. So okay. there's a seed a seed generator that you attach to it that basically predetermines everything. Got it. So um, this isn't like a slot machine every time you. No, hit a, no. Okay. It, well, the minute that we so when we tested the when you guys were just getting in. Uh, uh, Borf and I tested the, uh, the randomizer, and the first item that was random was the, uh, power bomb. So, mm. when we did it again, it was the power bomb. Oh. Wow. Yeah, because it's just, it's predetermined once you, once it coughs it out, so. I see. Um, but this is... Oh boy, here I we go. <laughs> <laughs> it's happening. It's happening! <laughs> Let's see, is this the... Oh, get the map, nice. You need a map? <laughs> Get it together. It's good to have. <laughs> it helps double check the work. I suppose. Um, did you guys ever talk to Jesse about some of his ideas for what season two of, of Good Game was going to be? For his character specifically? Mm -hmm. uh, I, uh, yes, we did. I don't remember exactly what they were. There was this bit that he wanted to do where he basically just wanted to he wanted to make it uh, The Dark Knight Rises where like Jesse is like Goes on a bender and disappears, and like goes into a dark hole and has to come back from being from game development. And he, wa <laughs> he wanted me and Alex Fostiani to be like his his cronies of like uh, like men trying to build him back up to climb out of the like the literal hole. Just like, and we were just like Desi, Desi, Dasha, Dasha, just from <laughs> from the Dark Knight Rises. That I always rules. it was always so funny because that's Jesse Jesse Cox is like the sweetest man on planet Earth. He's a yeah. very very he's nice the best. Man. Um, and he's always down to, to just mess around. And when he told me that, I was like, dude, I, it's too funny. <laughs> <laughs> we wanted to, I'm pretty sure we told this, we told the story on the show before, but we, oh, here we go. This is where, it, oh, I didn't save. I need to not do this. Oh, this sucks. This is bad. This is really bad. <laughs> so we, um, we, we started having this inside joke on the set that, um, this, the world that Good Game takes place in, uh, is the same as our world, except that Elysium, the film Elysium, <laughs> is like is like the, a one with, the one with Matt Damon. Yeah, mm -hmm. is like a Star Wars level, like cultural phenomenon. Yeah. So, so we would occasionally make references to Elysium as if we were making references to like Han Solo or something, yeah. like you would just do in daily life. Um, so there are a bunch of cuts of scenes where we just like ad libbed in some like Elysium references. <laughs> uh, and there's a couple I think I have clips of, but we, we ended up not using any of them. But <laughs> I had an idea to, to double down on it because uh, as a joke, there was like a Hollywood auction that was selling the Elysium armor. And uh, it was pretty affordable. And I was like, wow, this is like pretty cheap for a whole fucking suit of armor from a movie <laughs> that was screen used. And it comes with like a Matt Damon statue to put it on. And I was like, all right, as a joke, I'll bid on this. Just the minimum bid, and nobody else bid on it. <laughs> it's upstairs right now. So I won the Elysium suit, and uh, I still have it. And so we, we had an idea where, like, if we had a season two, we would work in a little bit more Elysium and have, like, a sequence where either I use the money that I won from... Uh, the tournament? Yeah, to, yeah. to buy the Elysium armor, which is worth... Hundreds of thousands of dollars in the universe. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, or I would have a dream sequence where, like, I would need, you know, like the talk to God moment of the script. Yeah. <laughs> where Matt Damon actually comes out in the Elysium <laughs> armor. Oh my God. <laughs> <laughs> like, see if we could just, like, get him, like, as a joke. Uh, so that was, uh, that was one of the concepts that probably wouldn't have come to fruition, but I thought was hilarious. It was fun. I cannot believe. That was five and a half years ago. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Yeah, yeah. It's it's so bizarre to me. When Jesse was first planning the show, because Jesse and I shared shared an office for five, six years. And so he didn't tell me that Dan Harmon was coming to the studio. And so Dan <laughs> Harmon rolls with all of his homies and they come in and I open the door 
I was like, oh, hey, guys, what's going on? Like, I just, like, lost. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, quickly, I, like, turned to my team, like, hide the shesh one sauce, please. Hide <laughs> it, please. <laughs> Pull the Rick and Morty posters down. <laughs> Throw them in the trash, quick. <laughs> And I think we all played uh, like a bunch of like StarCraft and League together just to like kind of have ideas for world building. I had nothing to do with the show, but I just was like, I'm a gamer. I play games. I Hi, Dan Hartman. That's great. <laughs> yeah, I love that shit. It was a great experience. You guys look like you had a lot of fun with it. I think that's what makes the show intrinsically so fun to watch. Is yeah. You know, it's the whole time we're just like two dudes just having a great time. It was Thanks, pretty fun. Man. Yeah, it was a wonderful experience. Like, it, it, even if that's like the only time we ever feel that, like, just knowing what it's like to film a show like that was such a cool, yeah, uh, new type of thing. Um, it was a very, it was an extremely stressful part of my life. Um, to, not not for reasons of the show, right? But uh, so it was like. It's 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 almost like half and half. I'm like, yeah, that show was awesome. Fuck, that was my first panic attack. <laughs> like, yes. oh. That was. So it was fun. But not the last. No, definitely <laughs> not the last. <laughs> oh, look at you loading up. That yeah, was smart. That was very smart. I kind of have to because I don't have the suit. I don't have the I suit. Don't have the suit. <laughs> look at this fucking. Fucking ghoulish, like flame ball, dude. Nice. He's fucking hilarious. Oh my god. <laughs> Ooh, I'm an undead. Ooh, Ooh you're about to die. And that dude. guy's like, hey, what's uh -oh. up? I'm also not here. <laughs> See ya. Holy shit. One yeah. tank left. Oh, this is, yeah, this Whoa. is why I just saved because I knew I wasn't going to make it. Oh, fuck. Oh my god. Yeah. <laughs> Reserve tank, which is only 30. Oh. oh All right, I got to piss, dude. Go, go piss. Ugh. I'm gonna do it. Good Look luck. Good luck. Doing it, dude. How is this gonna even be possible? I don't know, man. This is where it gets hard. <laughs> this is this is what, not what I was anticipating. Ah, oh, jeez. All right. Um. So, about Aaron. Yeah. I'm just kidding. No. <laughs> <laughs> isn't he? A, isn't he such a sweet guy? Yeah. Jesus, what's his problem? I know. He really is a nice person. Yeah. Fuck him. Yeah, I just, you <laughs> fucking hate to see it. <laughs> hate to see it. I like my friends who gaslight me and don't talk to me ever. I need drama. <laughs> <laughs> Some people would argue that's exactly what you need. Oh god. <laughs> the, so, is this even going to be possible? Uh, I hope so. I really hope so. What happens if? Oh god. I'll I'll figure it out. We'll, we'll get there. I really? think. Really? Yeah, we'll have to. We'll I'll try. No, there's 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 ways I can I can get through this. I just have to be patient and just kind of think about it. Okay. Um cuz we're surrounded by a bunch of item grabs. Okay. Uh, so the we're pretty close to to I have to assume getting uh, an item. Okay. Uh to or rather a suit, but it's just really rough cuz at this point I'd have more tools usually. I'd have like the the space jump or the ice beam mm -hmm. which could help a lot, but we don't have that, so it's making it a little tricky. Oh, a little tricky. A little tricky. Yeah. Um, Being patient and thinking things over are not our forte on this show. <laughs> <laughs> so this is. Uh, I just hope we're it's in not uncharted gonna, waters. Yeah, I hope it's not going to be. Oh, there we go. Nice. Thirty million hours of me failing, but we'll right. see. That's cool. The, I like. Uh, I love this background. It reminds me of centipede. Or Dude, Miller. it looks exactly like centipede. Doesn't it? It has. Welcome back, Aaron. That's wild. <laughs> yeah, it likes. It's got that millipede kind of. You know. Yeah, couldn't you like destroy some of those? I never really played that game. Oh centipede? yeah, you, you could shoot the mushrooms and stuff. And didn't yeah. you have a? Wasn't it a ball that you control it with? Y yeah, you're like a little. Yes, a tracking ball is yeah. what you play with. You're like a little. Uh, the motion that you made did not make it seem like it was. Yeah, I was doing like You're, a DJ motion. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Eric. We had a friend uh, in Philly named Eric, and that's how we always said his name, like Eric. <laughs> <laughs> Eric, Eric. I haven't thought of that in a long time. Wow. <laughs> Derek. Derek, I'm enjoying a treat, Derek. Oh man, that that video is ingrained in my head. Yeah, dude. Fucking what was that balloon shop? Is yeah, I think so. Called? Yeah. <laughs> oh lord. I joined a tree, Derek. I'm a hush puppy. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
Oh man. Oh, you don't lose energy when you're running like that? No. Cool. Yeah, you only lose energy when you stop to do the the super jump cuz then it like forces you to to go into a different direction. Wow. It's a little farming hallway. <laughs> bro, you're about to die, bro. A lesser man, perhaps. <laughs> wow. <laughs> you only got <laughs> You only got bombs. Yeah, these are the enemies that drop bombs, but now that we have full bombs, they should be dropping health. So are you any percenting, dude? That's essentially the goal. Hell yeah. Just to get through it as soon as possible so that we're not watching me fail over and over again for several episodes. Hey, you know, it's fine. We're 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 along for the ride. Yeah. We're here for the entertainment. Dropping bombs in your moms. <laughs> All the moms. <laughs> <laughs> Suppose so. <laughs> <laughs> Suppose I can make some time for that. <laughs> Pencil it in. What's your mom doing later? <laughs> <laughs> dropping bombs. Let me text my assistant. <laughs> Could you pencil me in? 4.30? Dropping bombs in Gerard's mom? <laughs> moms. You. Yeah, moms, sorry. Multiple yes. moms. Yes, yeah. <laughs> All five of them. <laughs> a very weird household. Yeah. Sorry, six. My bad. I got it wrong. You don't get energy for saving? No, I wish. Why not? <laughs> it's just like, I, like really unproductive questions. Do you want me to call up Shigeru? <laughs> Shiggy? Yeah, Shigzy. D dear old Shiggy. Is this a Miyamoto game? No. No. No, this is... He probably consulted on it. But. Yeah. He really is Metroid and, uh... Or he's Mario, Zelda, and Pikmin. Oh, is that all? Yeah. Well, Kirby's not him. Yeah, that's, that's, uh, that's Mr. Masahiro Sakurai. Wow. Smiley man, guy who still looks like he's 18, Dude. but he's like 58. And he's like a prominent, like thriving YouTuber now. <laughs> that's right, he's got yeah. a YouTube show. That rules. Man, what a world we live in. Yeah, right. Remember when fucking game development was so fucking mysterious? Yeah. You get like an issue of Nintendo Power and you'd see some sprite that doesn't appear in the game anymore and you're like, Where, the, where did that go? Where did that go? You'll now, never know, ever. Now, me, now, freaking Shigeru Miyamoto's or uh, Master of Sakurai is a YouTuber, and Hideo Kojima is a podcaster. Oh, is he? He has his own podcast now. Is it in Japanese? Uh, there is a Japanese version and a English version. Wow, that's incredible. Yeah, he debuted at but the, the English version is unfortunately in Japanese. <laughs> 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 Just the title of the podcast is in English. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you were gonna go right. I knew it. I'm just gonna get some. I'm gonna go use ah! the, the health the health machine. <laughs> the health machine. There's like little waypoints you can grab that. Oh, you stick your little hole you in stick it. Stick it in the dongle, and you know, probably the long way to do this. Stick but. it in my health hole. <laughs> Take it up my health hole, yeah. Derek! Just a, just a really, like, high-quality sample of, like, <laughs> This is, like, going into your body. <laughs> it's like, damn, the fidelity on this is fantastic. <laughs> the little block! <laughs> no! <laughs> Stop! Don't! <laughs> Stop. Ooh, don't touch me! Was damn that a monster it. face? St oh, I'm gonna die. Oh, oh Jesus Christ. Oh, 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 oh. <laughs> Hey, don't take the Lord's name in vain on our Christian show, dude. You're right. Mm -hmm. Welcome to Holy Grumps. <laughs> it's really important that you, uh, stay true to the Lord. Yeah. The Lord and the Lord. Can we add in sound effects for that? Just real squishy, disgusting sound effects when it... <laughs> when it goes in. <laughs> We're going full geeks on this, po on this show. I almost said podcast. Every Let's Play is a podcast. I mean, it technically is, yeah. yeah. I get a lot of messages like that. Yeah. I listen to you while I'm doing other shit, so I don't have to pay attention to you. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you. I yeah, appreciate that. Yeah, it helps me get my actual work done that makes a difference in the world. Cool, thanks. <laughs> I see how you guys fail at stuff, so it makes me feel better that you... That I, I can see <laughs> a lot of that. <laughs> <laughs> Seeing you be hot garbage at everything you do really makes me feel like I could be anything. Wow. <laughs> Good. Well, I'm glad I inspired you to Neat. do your best or whatever. It's great. So now you're going back to Varia Town. Yeah, I'm gonna try and find a, a solution somewhere. Think you're gonna make it? Are, are there other spots that you can go and find? Oh, I got another energy. Uh, thing. there are. Uh, yeah, there are. 
I just they, they suck to get to. So I'm gonna try. Uh, okay. and, well, this sucks to have yeah, to do over and over again. Yeah, so. yeah. So there, like there's pick a, your poison. Can yeah. you do a bomb there? I can, but if I I don't have the suit, so if I fall through the water, it actually makes it harder to get from one area to the other. Uh. Actually, I think we may be SOL because I don't have the ice beam, and I can't I can't get through this part without the ice beam because you have to use the ice beam to climb out of here. So uh, we might we might just be screwed and have to find the items in Norfair. Well, actually, let's see. Let's see. If, oh, actually, yep. I don't know if I can. Let's see if this is if this will go away. Okay. Oh God, that's really tight. I think I think I can do it. You could do that. That was easy. That was like. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> I mean, because you did something similar to it that was like way harder. Yeah. Earlier. It's fucking easy. I can do it. Give me the controller. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, I think I can do this. No! Look at him go. Look at him go! Oh, come on! Just gotta time it right. There oh, we go. There we go. That's some fucking Italiano Mamma Mia. <laughs> Is it? <laughs> <laughs> Dan? <laughs> that was a spicy meatball. Okay. Yeah, I guess so. Dan, you're not helping. Sorry, sorry. <laughs> I thought you were my paisano. <laughs> <laughs> Turns out you're just my jabroni. <laughs> Ooh, can, wow. I, get, oh, can no. I get through this? Okay, let's see. I like when the piano comes in. Ooh. Dude. Oh, maybe I didn't want to... Okay, I'm just gonna... Oh, no! This sucks. No! Holy fucking shit, dude. You got four energy. I just need to do fine. Oh! Oh god, my butt is fucking clenched no! as shit, dude. Oh, I died. Damn it! That was incredible. You know what? I give you points. Because that was pretty dope. Thank you. I probably would have just panicked and died. But you just like completely kept your cool through that whole thing. I was hoping that um, the way she dies is so fabulous. Yeah, ah, she's like, <laughs> check me out. <laughs> <laughs> Fucking beautiful. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to cut you off there, Gerard. No, it doesn't matter. <laughs> No, it's fun. It's fun. Yeah, nothing it's fires in this fucking world. Nothing. Why is there a little Tamagotchi here? That was yours? That was mine. That was, uh, that was a little stocking stuffer from, uh, Christmas at my in-laws. Oh, that's cute. Yeah, it's, it's lovely. It's, it's dead. The yes. battery's dead. You and the, and the Tamagotchi, killed it. The Tamagotchi was dead, too. It's, it's R2-D2. Oh, and it's I Star Wars themed. Yeah. yeah. I didn't know how to Tamagashi. how to do it, so he immediately got carried away by the Jawas, and that was it. <laughs> <laughs> what do you mean you don't know how to? You go to feed, and then you feed it, and then that's it. Oh. Wait, the, <laughs> is that how it dies though? The, the Jawas take it away to sell it? Yeah, and then then you like all you see is like the little Jawa vehicle like rumbling down the street, and you can't do anything else. You have to reset it in the beginning. <laughs> Damn, on this little screen? <laughs> yeah, I know. It was pretty impressive. Oh, feed it. <laughs> <laughs> I guess. I guess narratively, it doesn't really make much sense. No. It's probably they probably like did a like an in-universe style. Like, oh, put oil in it or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Got to grease his wheels. But I do understand why those were like very popular. Like, it does make you feel like, what is this? Oh. Full yeah, enough. like you're accomplishing something and well, it's funny because as, as a kid I was way into Digimon I think I had a Tamagotchi too, but I fucking love Digimon um, and uh, <laughs> I, I I just loved it and it was great. I love taking care of it and it was awesome And then as an adult I was in Japan and they just kept making Tamagotchis like it's the fucking cure to cancer <laughs> So they're like color screens and they're fucking make noises and shit. It was great wow. So I was like I'm gonna get the new Tamagotchi and I got it and immediately it was just like full anxiety meter in real life, because it was just like I gotta shake it, I gotta, uh, yeah, and it's yeah. just beeping at me, and I'm like, oh fuck, I gotta fucking, and there's like this beautiful shit happening like right in front of my eyes in Tokyo, it, like we're at a shrine, and I'm like, shut up, I'm fucking feeding my little creature. It reminds it pooped. me so much of um, 
uh, you know Mark Marin, the comedian? Yeah, yeah. 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 Very funny guy. He, uh... He's one of the greats. Yeah. He had this thing where he talked about, like, his anxiety about the idea of being a dad. He was like, when I think of, about having a baby, uh, I only think two images. Uh, I'm paraphrasing this. But one is like, oh, look at this beautiful creature. Like, it, it's me. It's the, the continuation of life, and it's in my hands. And then the only other image I have in my head is, oh, God, it's dead! <laughs> <laughs> And yeah. I get that. Yeah. I get that anxiety. Yeah. <laughs> That's how I feel about Tamagotchi. <laughs> right. Yeah. This beautiful, it's, it's just the circle of life here. <laughs> then you just see a little little tombstone with like a little <laughs> smiley ghost. <laughs> Oopsie doopsie, reset. My god. Alright, so... We're gonna try. You're gonna try to find some items. Yeah, I'm gonna try and do some some more game breaking stuff if I can. Just rolling the fucking dice here. Here we go. Yeah. So I, here's I guess that's what you chose to do from the very beginning. It's true. We're in, dude. So here we go. If we use the ramp at the end of this, whoa! We go up here, and then, bomb. Stop. Fuck you, dude. How would you even know that? <laughs> That's rude. Oh my god. What's worse is that this area is actually very difficult to get through. It's just stupid hard and everything's trying to kill you. I mean, I guess that's the point of the game, but... Yeah. What do you think the people who go, ah, ah, are at now? <laughs> what? <laughs> In the music. Oh, like, oh yeah. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> <laughs> What do you think they're doing now? Uh, hello, my name's Martin, and uh, I did all of the, uh, ha! in Metroid. Yeah, it's like their Twitter profile. <laughs> the whole ha guy in Super Metroid. <laughs> the ha guy from Super Metroid. So that's not useful. It is not useful, uh, but there is a, um, there are two items at the end of this path that we are gonna try and, we can only choose one, so it's completely random, oh, otherwise we have to run through. Uh, the nice thing is that, uh, well, I mean, ho hopefully that not only are those items good, but if, if they are bad, we only have to do We won't have to come back and do another run. Okay, um, but it's we just have to hope that there are some actually good items behind there Otherwise, uh, I'm gonna try and get through the ghost ship with no uh, Real items to get through it. So hopefully I don't have to do that. But De definitely. Yeah, Dope. That's that's what I was thinking too. <laughs> So what? What I was going to suggest it, but yeah. So why don't you you tell the audience? Yeah, uh, for their benefit. What, what yeah. items you're you're trying to get right now? Uh, we need at least uh one of the two suits. Right, right, right. right uh, right. and the grapple beam. Yeah, the two suits and the grapple beam. Of course. Yeah. yeah so yeah, here yeah. we go. We're gonna find out what they are. God, please be, please be a good item. It's not. I mean, if you're telling me there's like two hundred missiles. Okay. Yeah. Those are. Yeah, this is not going well. <laughs> <laughs> I did not hear an exclamation of joy. <laughs> Would yeah. you like missile or super missile? Dude. Okay. At least we don't have to go redo that, so that's nice. But everything else. Oh, because like if it was two really important items. I have to, yeah, I can I have to do that whole loop again. Yeah, but you're the you're the complete boy. <laughs> that's what they call me. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so there's there's actually something I can do here. All right. Let's see. Let's hope for a good item. It's usually not a great item, but RNG could be helpful. So, let's fucking RNG it, dog. Let's do it. We're going to roll that dice. RNG. Rigatoni and Noki. <laughs> <laughs> Favorite Italian dish. I just I just got pasta on the brain, honestly, like and no, I want pasta. I'm super hungry. Like I'm, I'm eating like 1,400 calories a, a day. Fucking ridiculous, man. 1,400. Yeah. Isn't that wild? You gotta create a Six deficit. Six foot two. That's not a lot. No, it's not. No. And it's not technically very healthy either. Why do it? <laughs> because I'm trying to lose 45 pounds. Oh, okay. Yeah. Can I kill these things? I technically can. Hey. Okay. Globules. That's what I call them. 
They do look like something you'd find on like the sneeze guard at a Cracker Barrel. <laughs> <laughs> I was thinking. I was thinking about that episode of Rocco's Modern Life, where Spunky has like the the thing from the trash. Mm -hmm. Oh, the little <laughs> green glob. Yeah, that like grows. Okay, so here's what I have to do. Just having fun right now. No, so <laughs> <laughs> having a bad time actually. Thanks for bringing. So. It up. When you run fast, right, you get the little blue orb stuff, the little yeah. blue trail. I have to run fast enough and then press down the minute the trail starts. And if I do that, I can store the the PM super the balls. jump. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> That's where it's stored. That's where it's stored. Everybody knows. Yeah. Ah, nice. shit. Oh. Whoop. Man, that's like it. fucking pixel perfect. I think what I might have to do is like. Uh -huh. a little bit. No. That's clever though. Oh, Give yourself don't, a little. Don't, don't fuck it up. A little breathing room. Oh! Ugh. Oh, there it was though. There it was. That was it. That means it's possible. Not just probable. Damn it. Come on, Stop man. falling in the kombucha. <laughs> <laughs> It's gonna age your no. digestion. <laughs> and you don't want that. Samus is promoting good gut health. <laughs> Shit! Fuck. The goo blobs are back, dude. I know. Did you notice? <laughs> I did notice. <laughs> Earlier I told Gerard that the goo blobs were back. <laughs> well, I don't think he noticed it did first. You, what, did you hear what I said? <laughs> This do yeah, it? can you bomb them? Yeah, dude. Nice. Yeah, they'll do it. Fucking AOE, baby. There we go. That should be all three. Look at that. Sweet. Oh man. How am I gonna do this, boys? Oh man. Who? Who we? No. Do it with the door. You had it going with the door. The door was easy mode. Yeah, you're right. I just need to get the. I need to get the the practice of storing it because playing on a on a Xbox controller, I'm, I always fuck this up. I know Xbox makes inferior controllers. Damn it! PS5 for life. I do love the PS5 controller. Uh, hashtag Sony underscore Yen. <laughs> <laughs> and oh. No. Come on, come on, come on! Ah! Oh, I was trying to see if I can like maybe jump and then yeah, story. but that was fucking right to the end. What the hell? Oh god, it's so frame perfect. Have you done this before? Yeah. Oh, Okay. Just needed to know it was possible earlier today, yeah. actually. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I practiced it on it the way. While you were in the bathroom. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> I think I have to give up on that, otherwise we'll be here for forever. Okay, I think I'm gonna try and go to the ghost ship area and see if I can get through that. With the okay. high jump boots, I should be well, okay. Well, you know what we can do? We can actually, because we're already 77 minutes in. Oh yeah. my god. We can, we can do another episode of this and you can try it off camera. Sure, that yeah. works for me. Cool. Nice. Cool. Right. Well, next time on Guest Grumps, maybe we'll finish this. I don't, I actually don't know, so. Yeah. We were, we were going so well. We'll see. Uh, We're goodbye, not qualified everyone. enough to Bye. say. Bye! Yeah. <laughs> I'm going to go acquire some cookies from upstairs. Do you desire anything?